So in this video, I'm going to walk through with the process of building a beautiful knowledge base website. Here, I'm choosing Elegance Template from Bullets Gallery. So click on Use Template. And I am signing in with my Gmail account. Now, you'll show up with two options and I'm choosing the first one since I don't have any existing site. After that, I'm naming my site and click on Next. Now click on Duplicate Template which will redirects you to your Notion account. This is the duplicated template and I'm changing the name of the template. This elegance named page will be the home page of your site. The home page is the root of your site, represented by a slash in the path column. Here, for any page you can edit meta title, description and keywords in the Notion properties for your site search engine optimization. And the page contains sidebar and main content. So, in sidebar the topic are categorized and these are just for your reference. You can go through with the categorized topic by clicking on them. This subpage also has sidebar, main content and table of contents. You can also add your own category with subtopics in the sidebar. So, I am adding my own category called knowledge base. And the slash in the path represents the root page of your site and in components, you'll find all the Notion blocks used in this template. You can cross-check with the website to see how every block renders on the site. In getting started, you'll find the usage guide of this template. If you want to keep a page in draft and prevent it from being published, simply uncheck the publish property and it won't be rendered or published. Once content is ready, click share, then publish, and copy the Notion URL. Now paste the URL and click on Apply and Create to render your site in Bullet. And the site is published and now get into Bullet Live Dashboard for designing your site. This sidebar says the features of Bullet. In Navbar, you can add call to actions and other links for easy navigation. Here I'm removing unwanted links from my site and add in my own category knowledge base as one of call to action and linking directly to its Notion page. You can also link it to URL and click on Save. Similarly, in Footer also you can add your own social media links and other components like Logo and Click Save. And in Pages sections you can able to preview your site before publishing it. In the Code section, you can add custom CSS and this happens when duplicating the template. The CSS is based on the template you choose. Removing this CSS will make your site look exactly like it does in Notion. When you paste the CSS, it appears a beautified site. You can also add your own CSS to further customize the appearance. And in Theme section, you can also change the mode of your site. You can even change your brand color, and click on Save. Likewise, you can customize your topography, layout, and other elements to give your site a more professional appearance. In Settings, Bullet even allows you to add a custom domain to your site. You can also secure your documentation or specific pages with passwords using membership and lock features, making them accessible only to your team members. Once all the customizations for your site are complete, click on Publish. Now, my site has been successfully published in Internet with all my customization.